It is nothing short of fraud for what the mechanic did to my vehicle. In order to cause damage to my power steering pump, they overfilled my reservoir. The damage I'm going to explain in this video that's possible, but one of the things that I didn't include that is also possible is the fact that that leaking fluid, if the engine is hot enough, could cause a fire, thereby destroying the vehicle completely. And just to give you an idea of exactly how much fluid I removed from the power steering fluid reservoir, I'm going to show you a picture in a Gatorade bottle that's a 20 ounce Gatorade bottle that is filled approximately one fifth of that bottle full. For those of you who are familiar with my channel at all may remember that I conduct regular preventive maintenance checks and services on my 2004 Nissan Xterra, affectionately referred to as Sarah. She is the platform on which I am able to provide the opportunity for this channel. Without her, the channel in its present form ceases to exist. That is why I work tirelessly to ensure that the vehicle is performing at its highest level. Much of the work I can do myself but on occasion, I will defer to a mechanic for assistance. A couple of days ago, I brought Sarah to the Midas in Universal City, Texas. Ordinarily, I would be including this information in a video in order to give the service staff their kudos for a job well done. Unfortunately, I am unable to do that at this time. The initial reason that I brought the vehicle to the shop was a slow leak in the left rear tire. I have roadside hazard assistance that would cover the repairs of that tire and I also requested a tire rotation. Initially, they were going to charge me for that service until I reminded them that these services were included in the initial tire purchase. And finally, I requested an oil change. As I observed each of the individuals in the waiting room coming and going, I noticed that each one of them had been upsold on one service or another. So I was pretty sure that I was going to be subject to this as well. Sure enough, after about 20 minutes of work being done and the technician pretty much getting close to finishing, I was called out to the bay and shown that my power steering fluid level was low and that there was evidence of a possible leak. Their assessment was that I needed to have the power steering pump replaced and the lines flushed. After several moments of going back and forth, I convinced them that if it was that serious or if it was a serious problem, I would be able to notice it after they just simply refilled the power steering pump fluid. They reluctantly did so and I paid and left, essentially saving myself over $600 in the process. Thankfully I didn't have far to go before I had an opportunity to pop the hood and check the oil level and the power steering level. I will not argue with the fact that it does look like there's a little bit of a leak on the hose itself and there's definitely some leakage that's going on right now but I went to a Midas in uh, San Antonio to ask them if they would um, change my oil and of course they came up with uh, the upsells that they normally do and one of the things that they were asking is do I need to or no I'm sorry they didn't ask they said that I needed to replace my power steering pump and the primary reason for that was a noise that it was making whenever you turn the wheel all the way to the right or left which probably was just a low power steering fluid in the reservoir and I asked them let's uh, go ahead and just refill the reservoir so that I can uh, see if that uh, noise continues with power steering fluid at the level it should be and based on what I'm seeing here you can see that there is a cold level cold max max hot should never be above that level right there and so they refilled it yeah that's uh, way full maintaining the proper power steering fluid level is paramount for the efficient operation of your vehicle's power steering system 
This hydraulic fluid plays a crucial role in facilitating smooth and effortless steering, thereby reducing the physical effort required to turn the wheel. Adequate fluid levels ensure that the power steering pump can generate the necessary hydraulic pressure contributing to optimal steering performance and preventing premature wear on essential components such as the pump, rack, and pinion. Low power steering fluids can lead to increased friction and heat within the system, potentially causing damage to vital components. Additionally, insufficient fluid levels can result in air entering the system, leading to foaming and aeration, which compromises the effectiveness of the power steering system. Regularly checking and maintaining the fluid level is essential to prevent these issues and ensure consistent steering functionality. On the other hand, overfilling the power steering fluid reservoir poses its own set of hazards. Excessive pressure within the system from overfilled fluids can lead to foaming, causing erratic steering behavior. This condition can also damage seals and gaskets, resulting in leaks and fluid loss. Furthermore, overfilling can strain the power steering pump beyond its designed pressure range, potentially leading to premature pump failure. In summary, the proper management of power steering fluid levels is critical for optimal vehicle performance and longevity. Regular checks and adherence to the recommended fluid levels help avoid from underfilling and overfilling scenarios, ensuring a seamless and trouble-free driving experience. I know that I can only speculate on another person's intentions, but it is my belief that they overfilled this reservoir in order to cause damages that I alluded to earlier. This would require me to seek out a mechanic for repairs, and if I was unaware of the implications behind their actions, it would very likely lead me to return back to them for the repairs. I also found it odd that the technician that I was dealing with was reluctant to give me his name, stating that it would be on the bill, of which, after further scrutiny, it only included the name of the manager, Stephen Ramos. It would be my suggestion that anyone who has an opportunity to consider a Midas shop, that they steer very clear of the Midas shop in Universal City, Texas on Pat Booker Road. Leaving this place, the sun's about to break, you're riding shotgun. The feeling would change, I'm wide awake, take me away now. Don't you blame me Yeah, this feeling I've got is making me crazy Making me crazy So I'm just gonna drive, drive, drive Underground old school, there's a shovel. Can you dig it, fool? Can you dig it, fool? Can you dig it, fool?